order to improve the mobility throughout our residential areas, the City of Edmonton is going to be calling a Phase 2 parking ban in order to uh, make sure that we're able to navigate our residential roadways safely. And we've seen a lot of fluctuating weather over the last couple of weeks, some freezing rain events in combination with the cumulative snow. Uh, it's created some icy conditions. So we want to send our crews in there to, you know, prepare and groom that top layer of ice and add, we'll be adding a, a sand and salt um, mix. Uh, due to the icy conditions, we'll also be adding a fractured rock chip to, to the mix designs just to have something adhere into that surface. So we're anticipating the parking ban to take seven to nine days throughout our residential areas. We will be placing signs at the entrances to the neighborhoods, um, identifying that our crews are on the way and will be in those areas within 72 hours. You can also check edmonton.ca slash safe travels. We have an online map and this map will identify what days your areas are scheduled to be complete. We do encourage citizens to talk to their neighbors uh, and make plans to get their crews off the streets. And this will give us the ability to move through our residential areas on time and on schedule and deliver a higher level of service. We do have alternative parking uh, locations identified on our website at some of our City of Edmonton facilities and partner, partners facilities. So you can go there uh, and look up your, your address and those areas are identified to provide alternative parking. On those city properties there's signage placed so people know where exactly they can park. Because this is the first time that the City of Edmonton has been implementing the Phase 2 uh, parking ban in our residential areas, We'll be working with our enforcement officers and just issuing educational warnings at this time, just to get citizens you know, uh, familiar with the process and how the parking van works.